Welcome back, everybody, once again to Kitten's Revolt. I am TJ the Obscure here with you. Did I get that chest? Oh, there's a button. Buttons. We must press the buttons. I I think we got it. I know we got that one. I went back to the monument uh, and searched around there for goodies. I also, there's a little cave with lava back there. I searched for goodies there. There was nothing there. I found in the waterfall in the monument a chest with a sign from Omega that said, I'm not supposed to give you anything, but I know you came up here for a reason, so here you go. And it had had a couple of potions in it, some slime balls, and then it had this Omega egg. I'm a little scared to use it, but we'll, uh, if it ends up being Omega, I kind of want to preserve. Oh gosh, okay, that's what I was worried of. Um, poor slime. Such a terrible, terrible existence. Just pop, pop into the world, and uh, oh look, he escaped. Hey, he is free. We have, we have freed the Omega. Um, okay, can we? Okay, yep, yep. You're just gonna hang out out here, okay, guy? I think they keep their name whenever they split into smaller slimes, but I'm not sure about that. We're heading into Nox Athena's area. I forget the name of it. I know the sign was out there, but I was too busy trying to escape from this. From the, wait, did I say slime or sign? The sign is out there. I was too busy trying to escape from the slime. More buttons. Press the buttons. Uh, it's something mines, I believe. We got vines and mines and and lots of lines on the wood or something. I don't know. I'm trying to rhyme. Vines, mines, and lots of rhymes. There we go. There we go. Kind of, sort of. Uh, but yeah, let's go and get to it, shall we? Let's see... What Nox Athena has in store for us. Uh, we know that there's going to be spiders. And now we know that there's going to be creepers as well. Bum, ba, da, bum, bum, bum. Destroy all the things. Is it going to be... Gosh dang it. I mined so much coal with my stone pick. And I was thinking, you know, we're probably going to get a... Uh, a fortune pick here soon enough, I would imagine. And indeed that was the case. Where is this spider spawner at? Hello, Mr. Spider Spawner, where you be? Aha, aha. Uh, do it, get it, got it good. Protection one, protection one. A wood sword, really. That seems really odd at this point. Let's go ahead and throw these guys on, though. And keep going. I think, yeah, we got enough coal for, for now. Let's get all this junk out of our inventory, though. And you, that chest has a sign on it. We probably want to read that. Friendly reminder that you need four saplings for a dark oak tree. Why would we need a dark oak tree? Exactly. And you're dead. So many vines. So many vines. What are you doing, little guy? You're going to attack me with an arrow now? You look so threatening. I love how the arrows like shrink in size. Did you see that? <laughs> That's hilarious. Did I did I grab this chest or did I just read the sign? I guess I just read the sign. Oh, more buttons and vines. Oh, I can't even place a torch. It's so cluttered. There's too much stuff going on. I'm making things difficult on me. And boom, you're dead. More apples. I'm going to leave those behind, I think. We can always come back and collect them. I have like two whole stacks of apples, though. I don't think we're going to run out anytime soon. And sure, we'll grab that as well. Oh, does this have speed? Oh, no, that has speed. Uh, Well, I don't have an anvil, I don't think. Or there is that partially broken one up there, but I'm not going to go all the way back up just to get it. As we could add protection two to our speed chest plate. Uh, one, two, three, and you're dead. What is that? Oh, this guy has a sword. He, he actually does look rather threatening. Um, no trespassing. Coal mine B. Coal mine A. Coal mine B. Let's go to A first. I think is a good idea. Watch out for traps. That would have been a perfect 
opportunity for a uh, for a tripwire trap. I need a better pick. Porter favor. Let's light that up sufficiently and grab the rest of our armor. Miner's hand axe. Miner's hatchet. Huh. Okay. Uh, wait, no, that's the one with speed. Gosh, that's so confusing. And I do want the one with speed, actually. I like the little, the little speed boost. Uh, go. Oh no, shooting you into the water is not gonna, not gonna work for us. Oh gosh, dang it! I'm, I'm losing this battle. <laughs> Just not good, not good. You might need this. Boats. I feel like we were maybe supposed to go to the other one first. Okay, there's nothing back there. As far as I can tell. Um, sure. We will grab... One boat. Just one boat. Um, okay. I was gonna try to get him to attack one of the zombies, but... Not worth it, I don't think. Oh, swing and a miss. Swing and a miss. You're so slow, guy. You gotta get faster if you wanna be able to take me on. He's gonna sneak up and stab me in the back. Isn't he? Gosh, I should probably eat. Hello, Mr. Buried Miner. You don't look very buried to me. Wee! Ooh, secrets. I'm liking this area so far. Very compact, but lots going on. I don't like this room, though. Ah. Wait, what? Now I feel like, is there something? Aha. Aha, a lot of d double secrets. Secrets time times two. Okay, we can't do anything with the gold block. Um, blast protection two, thorns unbreaking. And we got Nox Athena's head. Fantastic. I like my protection too, though. So we shall hold off on that guy unless we come across some gnarly creepers or something. Oh gosh, speak of the devil. Hello. Nope, we're just gonna leave you there. And the one, and the two. Oh, okay. Back it up. I think that's the objective. And if it is. This is a great map, I think, for beginners, perhaps. Dungeons aren't too large or too overwhelming. Challenges so far have been fairly simple, straightforward, easy. Uh, this would be the perfect map for people who are new to the genre. Or who aren't that great when it comes to PvE stuff. Okay. Well, while we're here, let's go ahead and grab a couple, uh, like a stack of coal or so. Should be good, I think. And let's go check out that other mine. I'm surprised I didn't set that off the first time. <laughs> okay, we got chickens. We got chickens. We, uh... Oh my gosh, it's so slow, you guys. <laughs> the, the chickens setting it off now. Hey, we have access to chickens though. That's that's something. We could get a better food source, slightly better food source. I also have that single pig back at the monument. All right, let's see. Let's see what's back here. I keep I keep expecting traps because there's a lot of good opportunities here for traps. I feel. Oh. Stay still so I can shoot you in your yellow head. And like so. Poor little poison. Nope, nope, nope. Ooh, that was so close. I almost got poisoned. Efficiency one. And sharpness one. Let's just go ahead and exchange those guys. And stick up all that junk. OK, 
Okay, I think we're I think we're good. Might as well grab a little bit more. And let's get out of here and head into the next area. Probably won't be able to take on the whole thing. But we can get started at the very least. Alright, and like I said, we should be able to combine these now. Something like that. Oh man. There goes that anvil. Let's stick our objective up. And uh, do something like that. Make sure we stick our head up as well. And, uh, yeah, let's see here. We have Fungal Gardens. Who is the creator of Fungal Gardens? Area made by Blam. I haven't seen Blam around much on the Discord, although people change their names so often that it's hard to keep track of everybody. I don't think I've changed my name once. That's interesting. I like it. Uh, ooh, okay. Mushrooms. One of the areas I made recently uses mushrooms. Um, oh, that's interesting, switching them around like that. I would never think to do that. Oh, hello. Oh, gosh, okay. Well, wasn't expecting that. And I think he has fallen to his doom. What do we have below us? Oh, just water. So he's, he's probably still alive. He's okay. He is not dead. It's like when, um... Okay. It's like in, like, Disney movies where you know that the, the, the character clearly must have taken some serious damage, but they don't actually show it. You know? And the kid asks, like, Mommy, Daddy, is he okay? And you just gotta lie to your kids. Oh, it's amazing how acceptable lying to your kids is. Elf on a shelf, Santa Claus, all that kind of stuff. Oh, gosh. I hope none of you still believe in Santa Claus. If you do, he's totally real. I'm sorry. <laughs> oh, wait. No, I... Yeah, I... Okay. Santa Claus is real. Elf on a shelf is not real, though. That's that's a total lie. Um, <laughs> okay. We uh, we have a couple different directions we can go. I, I like this dungeon a lot. I like how vertical it is. I love I love dungeons like this. Oh no! Okay, let's get up to the very top. Something tells me there might be something up here. Break it. Should be using my axe. Not sure why I'm not. Uh, is that the end of the vines? Nope. Oh gosh. Get up there. Okay. Get up. Get up. Get it. Got it. Good. No. Nothing. There must be something. Oh, there is something over there. Um, I almost wonder if we're like supposed to follow the leaves up or something. I see a sheep. Let's, uh, how do I want to do this? I don't want to go straight over there because there's a spawner. Although it does depend on what kind of spawner it is. So let's see if we can set it off. I'm assuming it's one of these skeleton spawners. Really? We're still not close enough? Huh. That is shocking. Shocking, I say. Oh, why are my arms so short? Um, I'm surprised. I'm really surprised it has not been set off yet. Oh, you were not who I was expecting. I thought it was going to be another one of these archers. Boom! And where did you come from, Mr. Creeper? Sneaky, sneaky creeper spawner. Uh, oh, hello. Hello. Um. Oh gosh, no, that didn't work. That didn't work. That worked. That worked. Yep. Okay, you're trapped back there forever. Let's see what's in this direction. So this could be a, the path to another intersection. But I guess it's just a continuation of the area. Where'd the creeper go? I know you're over here somewhere, guy. Oh, boom. Oop, I thought that XP orb was a... Was a... Was a... Was a spawner. Was a thingy. Oh, more of you. More of you. 
we're just gonna go over here. Destroy your home. Come over here, hide in the corner like a coward, while we destroy the creeper's home. And then we're going to go up on top of the mushroom, because I feel like it, gosh dang it. One of those guys over there, I think I might see the objective, and now I feel like I went about this uh, in the wrong way. Oh, so much junk. So many things. So many things. Oh my gosh, you guys. Oh. Go, 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 go. Run, 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 run. Are they still tracking me? I think they are. Um, that, that, that. Okay, we have some privacy now. Tribute to Blam. We, of course, still need to go through the rest of the area. Hey, I totally forgot that I have that. Oh well, whatever. Um, and find the, the head, right? What does this have? Flame and power two. Okay, we make our daring escape. We. Uh, oh gosh. Oh gosh. I don't know. Okay, that I think just takes us back down. I don't have feather falling. Gotta be careful jumping things. We. Oh, you're still there. Hopefully, he will forget about us. Maybe not. The other guy, I think, has despawned. We have access to iron now. We are playing this dungeon backwards, you guys. That's another one of the archers. And there's one of the sword guys. Oh, gosh. Okay. Um, nope, nope, nope. Oh, gosh. Okay. Uh, well, that was totally planned, totally planned, totally planned. I, how, what? Okay. The layout here is very intriguing, kind of, kind of confusing. Nope. I really need to play a, a pacifist kind of mode, I think. Okay. Oh, gosh. Um, oh, yeah, that works, that works, that works. I'll take it, I'll take it. Uh, hello, everybody. Let's do something like this. One, two, three, one, two, three. Everybody is blocked off now. And I think we are safe. Boy, the difficulty level picked up very quickly in this area. Protection three. Ooh, that's a... That is one powerful, powerful item right there. Uh, I think we still need to make it over there. Let's go back down. Oh, you're still there. Boom! How are you not dead? Took a creeper blast right to the face. Oh my gosh. It's a party. But yeah, that's, that's a party. Okay. We're going to have to take the alternative route then. Uh, which involves... Uh, jumping over here. And a jumping over there. And jump in all the places. Shoot you with an arrow. Oh gosh, no, that was not good. That was a bad idea. Bad idea. Ugh. Um. Hey, look, there's a staircase. Interesting. Let's eat some soup. I'm feeling like I'm in a soup mood. Oh, I totally forgot that I had the objective objective on me. Hello. Come to me. My zombie friends. Can you... Okay. Oh gosh. Um, uh, oh gosh, okay, I don't know, things are not, not, not going well, not going well, I'm just gonna hide in the corner, uh, let's switch to that, cause we need it right now, right, I think so, we found a door, oh, let me eat, let me eat, let me eat, 
More soup. Oh, those guys are persistent, are they not? Uh, that's a long staircase. I would like to get back up, if at all possible. Are you guys? No. Nobody is there. I think... Oh, gosh. I say, I think they all followed me down, but... There was at least one... One guy that was still up here. Break a U. And we have made it back. Oh my gosh. Okay. Okay. You're... You got axes, and that's terrifying. Let's switch back to our bread. I probably need to end the video. Oh, but I'm having too much fun. Well done on this area, Blam. Hey, we're back here. Okay. And we are no longer back there. Oh, look, there's a spawner. There's a spawner right there, too. I love the layout of this area. Oh my gosh, and, and we found the head. There's secrets. This is amazing, you guys. Hey, we got a... Looks like we got a... Uh, uh, nope, that's not what we do. Clearly, clearly your assumption was, was not correct. Boom! Blow it up. I'm guessing this is just a shortcut, though. Indeed, that is the case. Let's collect the blocks. Let's get our axe where it needs to be. Didn't I have a... Yep, there it is. Sharpness axe. And... Boom. Okay. Two objectives. There's clearly still more stuff to do in this area. In fact, yeah, we should probably... Investigate the, uh... Little staircase at the bottom. Uh, uh, Take you out, and you, and you, and you. One, two, three, just like a so. Oh, but I like the speed. Gosh dang it. Um. Torches, torches, torches. We'll just make a few, because I am running low on inventory space at the moment. Stay away, stay away, stay away. Yeah, this might take us to the next intersection. Uh, Clockwork Cavern. Wait, what? That's the name of the third area. But I think we can access it from the intersection as well. That's interesting. Are you still up here? Hi. <laughs> He is bringing me a little mushroom present. There's stuff in this guy. Nope, apparently not. <laughs> I thought that was a little secret doorway, but that is that is just me fumbling around with my blocks. All right, well, let us climb back up. Mission accomplished. And uh, I'm going to head back to the intersection, and we'll place all this stuff next episode. Oh, look, he's climbing up with me. Anyways, you guys, that's going to be it for me for today. Thanks for watching, everybody. Hope you enjoyed, and I will see you next time.